Hey, it's Tom Gallagher, the video panure, and today we're looking at a 2022 Kia Soul LX. Here we go. So this Soul LX is featured in steel gray exterior with a black and gray interior as we take a look at the iconic new badging for the 2022 Kia. This vehicle is offered by Lou Fuse Kia in St. Louis, Missouri with a sticker price of $20,500. As we slide down the driver's side, you see the body colored door handles, mirrors with the, uh, the bottom of the mirror in black. Then black matches the bottom of the rocker, rocker rail across the uh, back of the bumper. Here you can see the 16 inch steel wheels with wheel covers and all season radial tires black shark fin antenna for additional information give josh a call his contact information is listed below there you can see the rear wiper defogger and again the 2022 kia badging sole badging on the back of the vehicle led tail lights and the black trim that runs from the uh, top of the doors to the uh, tailgate with the sole badging in the black trim there really a nice look to it as far as economy, this thing is big inside and easy on the uh, the gas. Another look at the 16-inch steel wheels with wheel coverings and the front grille. As we dive into the interior, here's the black and gray interior that uh, I mentioned earlier as we peer over the back seat into the cargo area. We'll show the cargo area in detail here in a moment. But the contrasting colors in here really brighten it up. Uh, personally, I prefer a lighter interior when it comes to shooting video. The black just eats up the light. And as you can see, plenty of light in here and it's easy to shoot. So that means it will be easy on your eyes when you're driving in the daytime and night. And black shows up. Uh, black carpet shows up so much dirt. as we pull out of the uh, the front and jump in the back seat. Now for a little BS with the video panure, I'm in the back seat of a 2022 Kia Soul LX. And as you can see, plenty of headroom, plenty of room all around. These vehicles are very roomy. Take a look. So as you can see, plenty of room in the back seat and in the front seat. So as far as the uh, comfort of the passengers, no complaints there. This vehicle has traction control, electronic stability control, vehicle stability management, hill start assist. As we take a look at the roominess from the behind the driver's seat, as you can see, just plenty of room in this vehicle. We have a 60-40 split fold down rear seat. And that's an eight inch touch screen on your infotainment. And we'll show that here in, a, in, a, uh, in detail in a moment. Cloth seating throughout. The gray seats with the contrasting black on the dash as well as on the door panels and the carpeting. As we tilt back and take a look at the headliner, uh, the gray headliner. So as we dive into the driver's side, you can see the door panel, part of the door panel is black. The bottom of the seats are black. So that contrasting color really shows up. We have an eight inch touchscreen, as I mentioned, Android Auto, Apple CarPlay, fingertip controls on the steering wheel. It is a man manual tilt telescoping steering column. Power side mirrors, power windows. There's the eight inch touch screen. And when we put the vehicle in reverse, you can see the backup camera with dynamic grid lines. Dynamic grid lines really come in handy when you're backing into a parking space. So you have your media, you can sync your phone with it, Bluetooth connectivity, remote keyless entry, 
steering wheel controls with Bluetooth, audio, and cruise as we punch through the functionality of the touchscreen. Additional power ports for the driver and the passenger here. So you have your 12 volt and your USB. We do have the drive mode. So you have normal and you have sport. And your center console. Nice and deep. Plenty of room in there to put your uh, larger personal items. And then in the door, door panels, as well as across the uh, dash, you have a contrasting trim, your glove box with your owner's manuals. As far as your cargo area is concerned, 26.6 cubic feet of storage with the seats up. Fold the seats down, and it's 62.8 cubic feet of storage carpeted floor mats that you can see right there. And when you lift up the cargo mat in the back, you can see the compact spare with all the tools. There's plenty of room there to put a pair of gloves, maybe a couple of towels, just in case you ever need to use that uh, if you have to, have to uh, change a uh, spare tire. As we button things up and take another three-quarter shot from the back of the vehicle. As far as the engine goes, it's a 2.0 liter four-cylinder engine, 147 horsepower, 132 foot-pounds of torque, so plenty of torque on this engine. Intelligent variable automatic transmission, drive mode select, we already showed you, idle stop and go. As 28 miles per gallon city, 33 highway, go ahead and hit the subscribe button in the middle Choose your next video. Leave us a comment. What do you think of this vehicle? Thank you again.